Hey guys, welcome to Cool Full-Time Family Adventures, where we take you along on our adventures, no matter how big or how small, an adventure is what you make of it. So hey, stick around, let's go have an adventure. Hey guys, welcome to Cool Full-Time Family Adventures. I'm Dennis, that back there's Radiance, and we stayed home this weekend because it was a pretty slow weekend. You know, we had an adventure. It may not have been a big one, but hey, an adventure is what you make of it. So follow us along this week, because this weekend we stocked the pond the boys' way, and I want to tell you a little bit about an allergy called Alpha Gal. Let's put it this way. We are now on a lifetime adventure with this allergy. So hey, stick around. You might go down and hit that subscribe button. It doesn't cost you anything. Hit the uh, bell icon so you get the notifications when we post on Monday night at five between five and seven. And hey, like and share. Share this because we're gonna learn about an allergy that not a lot of people know about. So let's spread the word about Alpha Gal. Alpha Gal is a tick-borne illness. And, uh, well, let's just put it this way. It's going to be a heck of an adventure this time. So, hey, stick around. Let's learn about it. So, hey, guys, we're hanging out with the boys today. And uh, there's a car coming, so I'll wait till it goes by. They got him a fish. It's about an inch long. About an inch long. But uh, I can't even zoom in on it far enough to see how small it is. I can't even see it from here. <laughs> there it is. There it goes. So I'm just hanging out with the boys this week. It's been a pretty slow week. Uh, but they're trying to restock the pond kind of their way. You can tell we're just... This is pretty much an overflow ditch or a small creek. They're just catching uh, pan fish, and uh, they're going to restock the small pond at the house so they can practice fishing. So hey guys, as I'm sitting here and I'm walking around the uh, farm where we've raised goats, we've raised sheep, we've raised some cattle. Those are all meats that we can't eat anymore. That's right. This tick-borne illness, Alpha Gal, is actually an allergy to mammalian products, meats, uh, gelatins of some sorts. And I'm not an expert on this because we just learned about this. My wife just got diagnosed with alpha gal, which is an allergy. So anytime she gets bit by a tick, and it's usually the ones with the little white dots on them, uh, they leave a bruise on her and a big whelp, and they hurt. And it makes her sicker than what she already is. So... I'm a meat eater. Well, she was a meat eater too. <laughs> so, she can't have anything except for chicken, turkey, and fish. So, I mean, those are probably, that's probably a good thing. Because now she can still have meat. It's just not red meat. It's not mammalian meat. Uh, pork, beef, uh, those kind. Deer meat. We can't have deer meat anymore. We can't have elk. We can't have buffalo. Things like that. Things that we've enjoyed before. We can't have anymore. I say we. Uh, my wife's the one that's allergic. So I guess I could. But hey. You always try to be the good husband. And support your wife. And uh, I'm going to try to do this. And, and support my wife. And go along with what she's doing. 
I do an all right job right now. Not very good, to be honest with you. Um, but I try. But, uh, I mean, deodorants. Deodorants have mammalian products in them. She can't use certain deodorants. Um, so pretty much my wife is now having to go vegan without wanting to go vegan. She can't even have chocolate because it's made from milk. That's right, milk. Everything's made from milk, ain't it? So, you know, uh, I just want to get the word out there and let people know about this tick-borne illness, this allergy. And the way we understand it, it's a lifetime allergy. So we are now on this lifetime adventure of Alpha Gal. And I will put up a link down in the descriptions to uh, some sites that you can learn about Alpha Gal. And uh, the way she learned about it is she was sick. Um, certain certain times, she, you know, after eating, and it could be three or four hours after eating, her lips would get numb and her face would get itchy. Things like that. So, I mean, it was odd. It was just a, like a an allergy that they couldn't find, basically. We couldn't figure it out. So finally, she went to the um, allergist and they ran some tests. And the next thing you know, she's got alpha gal. Her numbers were like a 0.33 when they tested her the first time, which is borderline. I think 0.35 is you have it. 0.33 is, uh, this don't look very good for you, but you don't have it yet, I guess. A borderline thing. Um, but she went in this last time and took test again, blood test, at her allergist. And she come back with a 7 point something, which is pretty much 7 times the limit of, or the number that you have to have to even have it. So now we're uh, watching this because it's kind of like... Oh, it's kind of like a bee sting. You get stung by a bee and you're allergic, you go into anaphylactic shock. This is a kind of the same thing. You get really sick, your throat swells up, your tongue swells up, you can't breathe, and out comes the EpiPen. So this is kind of a really big deal, uh, especially for us. We like our red meats, our beefs, our porks, that kind of stuff, but hey, we like chicken too. We like turkey, but just not every day, but we're going to get used to it. But hey, stick around. Let's see what else we do this week. And get the word out there. If you're having problems and you're sick and you can't figure out why, go to an allergist. You may have alpha gal. See ya. So, hey guys, that's about it for today. Um, just be aware of the tick bites and uh, treat your cats and dogs and so they don't bring them in the house. And hey, get out there and have your adventure today. Be sure to get out the word on Alpha Gal. And uh, if you're not feeling right and uh, it's hard to breathe, sudden weight loss, that kind of thing, um, go see your allergist and have them run an Alpha Gal uh, blood test. But anyway, Hey, go down and hit that subscribe button and uh, hit the bell icon so you can get a notification when we're posting, which is on Monday between 5 and 7. And hey, hit that like and share. Share with all your friends. Get the word out about Alpha Gal. But until then, we'll talk to you later.